This guy is awesome. He is not a comedian, but he is here tonight. Give it up for Thank you all. I'm not a comic, it's just that I'm married. I have no one to talk to. <laughs> Yeah, um, so, you know, in our house, like, we try to have, like, a strict corporate hierarchy. Uh, my wife is number one. Uh, our daughter is number two. <laughs> the dog is number three. <laughs> and I'm number four. And, uh, number one, two, and three live in the main site of our side. I live in a little room in the backyard. Which I call the branch office. And I'm fine with that. I can sleep in late. <laughs> There's only one problem though. Like, I have a neighbor who runs his lawnmower at the crack of dawn. It's like, you can't trust a person who has to mow his grass at 6 a.m. in the morning. You know? Come on, like, let me sleep. Broken dreams are all I got. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm married, but um, I don't wear the wedding ring because um, I feel like ugly people don't need to wear wedding rings. <laughs> and my wife is fine with it. You know, she's like, if you can find someone to have sex with you, by all means, go <laughs> She's supremely confident in my lack of abilities. So, I thought I need to do something, you know. Uh, so I joined a yoga class. <laughs> you know, get back in shape. And so this was like a hot yoga class. It's like really hot there, you know, and there are like this beautiful women in like beautiful yoga clothes and a couple of married, perverted guys like me. <laughs> And so I went there and they were wearing like, you know, breezy, airy yoga clothes, but I got man boots. I can't take off my shirt, you know, so after 30 minutes, it gets really hot and I start sweating and I'm like, I'm going to pass away. Let me go take a break. <laughs> Sit outside, grab some air, water. And then this beautiful girl in like a leopard leotard, she comes along and she's like, yeah, it's, it's too hot inside. I'm like, yeah, it's too hot inside. Um, uh, I think I'm done for the day, she says. I'm like, yeah, I'll, I'm done for the day also. Let's, uh... <laughs> you know. <laughs> <laughs> so we start walking back together to the parking lot. And um, now, as you have guessed by now, I have low self-esteem. <laughs> so I need to drive a fancy car. <laughs> and so I bought this um, Ford Mustang, the electric vehicle. And she notices the car in the parking lot. She's like, yeah, that's a nice car. And I'm like, 
actually that's my car uh, and she was like can I take a look I'm like yeah please come in take a look uh, so she gets in and I open the door and then uh, I show her I'm like this is the button and this is like the dashboard and then it's an electric car if you buy this you know you get a discount from the government uh, you get less taxes and she was like getting really impressed he's like wow you're really smart you know you, you did the right thing and I'm like yeah I am smart actually I came second once in uh, class in kindergarten <laughs> I once went to the final of a ping pong match. I didn't win. I don't get promoted at work, but I tried. <laughs> and as I'm telling all these things, her breathing is getting real heavy. You know, she she like walks in, you know, steps in closer, and she's like, "Please don't mind me saying this. I got a thing for middle-aged." Losers. <laughs> Do you mind if we make out? Um, I was like, no, but you know, um, I must let you know I am married. She's like, so what? I don't care. Do you care? Like, does your wife care? I'm like, actually, she told me that. <laughs> and I was like, is this really happening? And at that moment, at that moment, the lawnmower starts. <laughs> Same in the morning. 